So it turns out, it doesn't matter what you believe, it's what did you intend to do about it. You see, all of your leaders, they all swear on a Bible before they go into office, and these are the people that take your taxes that rule over you. And your silence was consent. So if you don't understand what this book is telling you, this is a weapon. It's telling you that in there, Corinthians 4.4, 4, that Satan owns this world. And I can see what's up. So when I put up gallons of my blood using those blood bank certificates under Satan, the Antichrist, the Prince of Darkness to release everybody from bondage and bring forth heaven and earth, that was published to the World Wide Web. Nobody contested it. And the great spirit of this earth gave me this spear of destiny and shows me her holy hole and how to take over the fucking universe. And it's just that simple. And nobody has to like it. You know, I, when I say I have the favor of your creator, I'm telling you, I look at the sun every day and talk to your creator. You don't even believe that the sun is conscious. That's the collective consciousness of the whole. How people are missing this is unfucking believable I look directly at the sun and I speak my intent. I don't ask for, for stuff. I don't pray for anything. I say, kindly give me the knowledge of the ages. I intend to bring forth heaven and earth in your name. And I remind you often, I get all my power from the sun. It's programming me to say specific stuff, do very specific things. And I'm sure within a year or two, I could get everybody eternal life. It's just that simple. All I have to do is just keep pointing out the way and lead the way in a couple of years. It's just that simple. So, you know, when you hear people talking about this blood over intent, calling it satanic, it's true that you are the most satanic motherfucker in the world. Every word you speak is a magic spell. You learn spell casting in school. You have God virus. You place the power of creation outside of you. Language is what the computer speaks. That's what you program computers with. That's why you watch TV programs all day. And... You graduate, you put on your satanic robe, everything about you, bowing your head in prayer at a funeral, blowing out the candle, making a wish, blowing on the dice, throwing the coin in the wishing well. I could go on and on and on for days. That you took your test with your number two shit pencil, number one is a peepee, number two is shit. The ash trailing light, the astral light, one side of a light holds a black hole with the green astral jet shooting out. At the center of the dish is the fountain of youth. There's no way to fuck this up. And uh, if you don't help out by making videos every day like this, your life is in my hands, and if I don't wake up enough people to cause an exodus to happen, you will die of old age or stupidity. That's the prescription of reality. You have the elements like earth, air, fire, water, ether. So what you could do is write on a piece of paper something selfless, like, I intend to bring forth heaven and earth for the benefit of all. Spill your blood on that, and then burn this in a pot on your nightstand right beside your bed at midnight and call out to the universe asking the universe for guidance you need to keep this completely selfless people and uh, you'll gain an elemental power out of the universe associated with fire and it is this simple you write out a piece of paper you know I've boiled my intent a selfless intent and poured it, the cooled off water into an aloe vera plant what I'm saying to you is that water Earth, air, fire, the Ethernet, like I've written one out, uh, published it to the Ethernet originally, and then I did another one a year after, uh, using gallons of my blood with the blood bank note certificates. And what I'm saying to you is that each one of these different things that I do adds another, you know, elemental type ability to see stuff that nobody else can see. And uh, it's going to be easy to take over this world. Because everybody's a little pussy, and they can't see anything. Surely, if you have children, then you've seen them watching Cartoon Network, and maybe you've caught one of the shows that they're watching, like this Dragon Ball Z, and you see this character, this dog character, you know, he prides himself on destroying worlds. You know, I'm going to blow up a world with a thought. You know, just running around, blowing up this world, that world. And then he comes to Earth, and he meets all these Super Saiyans. And, you know, they come to this... Town of Satan City. No way to fuck this up. This is Satan's world. You know? You don't, it doesn't matter what you believe. You could be a fucking atheist. Your leaders put their hands on that fucking Bible. And that Bible says this is Satan's world. And I got gallons of fucking blood as Satan. And I can see shit nobody can see. You know? I'm going to lead us all to the Holy Grail. There's going to be an exodus. I've gone super saying, you know, nobody's going to come here and destroy this world. Everybody thinks they're on a ball floating through space as a monkey, but there's a dome up there. You know, they believe in meteors and all this other shit, and everything turns out to be fake. So, 
eventually when it sinks in that the fountain of youth is real and you could become an eternal being by drinking from the living waters, gazing upon the astral light at the center of the flat earth plane, once it sinks in, you know, and you realize everybody that you know is sleeping, there's zombies literally dead. You know, you're going to say, it's true, quasi-luminous is the prince of darkness. Because now everybody around you, you can't wake them up. They're all zombies, legally dead. You could scream at them, ah, 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 but you can't get through to them because they're filthy monkeys lost in a ball through space. They have no divinity. And until you, you know, can grasp this idea that this world is fixed, that it's like the division symbol. There's the dot above that spirals in, spirals out, and it must drip its blood in the center of the dish. Or there's no aurora borealis coming out. There's no way to fuck this up, you know. One side of a light hole is a black hole. When this sets in and you realize this stuff, you go super saiyan. And you realize that you're holding the spear of destiny. And we're going to get there in two years. And it's not going to cost anybody anything. This is biblical type shit, people. You need to grasp this concept. Okay? This is biblical. We know where the fountain of youth is. We're going to get there before we're dead. You don't have to like it. But when I published that video, Under the Prince of Darkness Speaks, the angel of death became one with me. And uh, I can see that nobody can stop me. Until your blood is beside my own, the angel of death has you in his book. And it's exactly this way for a reason. Because you're legally dead. You have no right to this world uh, until you come back to life. Your creator wants proof of life. And uh, nothing's going to get in the way of bringing forth heaven on earth. This is by divine order. You will join me or die, motherfucker. I'll remind you often, I'm standing here as Satan. On gallons of motherfucking blood, the spirit of death is one with me. I can see all the horrors of the universe. And I'm telling you, I put up my blood to get the spirit of death the rest of eternity off. And uh, the spirit of death shows me everything. My teacher, we're in the same boat. We gave up our free will. There's a book of life and a book of death. Nobody has to like it. Heaven has come to earth. Until your blood is beside my own, you're in the wrong book, motherfucker. You will publish your blood over your intent to the Ethernet beside my own under blood over intent on YouTube, or you won't. It's one book or the other. I'm sorry. This is my world now, and heaven's come into this place. Nobody can stop me. The angel of death will get you before you get me. It's just that simple. This is by divine order, motherfucker. You will join me or die of old age or stupidity. I'm informing you as Satan himself, standing on gallons of motherfucking blood, that I have this mythical spear. And uh, I'm taking over your world. Nobody can stop me. All I see is filthy, retarded cockroaches everywhere. I'm informing you that you're lost at sea, you're legally dead. You're a filthy, retarded monkey floating on a ball through space as an accident. And... You were fed the reverse of truth in all things. There's no way you can stop me from taking over your world. You're so filthy, sickly retarded, it goes beyond measure. If I don't make videos every day pointing out the fountain of youth, you will surely die. That's the prescription of reality. There's no way to fuck this up. You will join me or die, motherfucker.